Time to get serious. Did we- wait, did we- Did we always start with three lives? Cause I know there's an ability later on where you can start off with like, more than that. Which, it's a worthless ability to be honest because... The game's- it's kinda, like I said, on the- it's, it's slightly easy and hard at the same time. It's like, the only difficulty really comes at the end, and like maybe the beginning cause you have nothing with you. Fucking bees. Why make robot bees? It's almost as pointless as like robot fucking um birds or something. Or robot slinkies in Mega Man 7. So let's try to power up here. And you can burn the tree! And um the heart piece will be um and actually, it's this one right here, actually. Wait, did I just get hit by the fire? Seriously? You see how there's the, the, a slight stop when you um, just press dash to dash everywhere? That's why I, I just dash jump everywhere. You don't have to worry about that shit. Now, pay attention to the health bar to the enemy here. It's not going to be the R like the Repo Force. I think. Yeah, no, 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 no. You labeled us... Uh, no, this Repo Force shit. You labeled us as all as Mavericks? I won't let you pass. Turn back now. Shit. Okay, we're gonna get to the other guys that's not the Repo Force eventually. Ow. I won't recommend you this is the first boss you fight at zero, because you, like I said, you gotta get up and personal. It's kind of hard to do a zero. So this is the part when he starts to get tough. He's gonna start throwing like fucking spiders down, which is annoying as hell. Shit. That that that's like his most damaging move right there. Got him. Well, it's either um the spot that web move, or him actually touching you, because touch damage is, hurts really hard in this fucking game. Yeah, Mega Man. I got the lightning web. <sighs> this power, I don't like it. <laughs> Like, you, you'll see why I don't like it when we, uh, get the buster power up. Fuck, what, what voice did I give him? Oh. Sir, it's just a message from the Colonel. X, I'll wait for you in the Memorial Hall. Make sure you show up on time. Sir, this must be a trap. Perhaps, but I won't run this time. When did you run? You didn't run before. <laughs> you didn't run away. He ran away from you! <laughs> um, I don't know Colonel's weakness. Uh, I might edit it in if I don't figure it out. <laughs> Colonel, stop this foolishness now! Never. I like being foolish. Colonel, please, think this over. The Rapper Force must be independent. Our battle will determine this. I've been waiting to fight with you. Ah. 
Yeah, he just teleports in front of you like an edgelord when he does that, so be careful. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I was like, is he just gonna teleport again? Ow. I think you can dash on the rope? Should I waste the fucking uh, and just... Eh, fuck it. Oh, no. Wait, no, give me it. Sometimes when you use soap tanks and heat tanks, it's like, oh, press X or press, you know, start. I always get confused by this fucking thing. Impressive, but the result won't won't be the same next until the next time. Until then, Colonel. I guess I'll leave too. <laughs> All right, I'm saving. No data. So I'm not. We're not at the halfway point, but we're pretty close. Alright, who are we gonna fight next? Ah, fuck. Where do we get the signal? Did we get the signal attack from- No, no, we get it from Peacock. Because we needed to fight, um, this guy. Storm Owl. Which, um, they don't bring it up, but the- I think it's either in the Mega Man X Complete Works or some shit. They bring up, um, Storm Eagle and Storm Owl's relationship. But they don't bring it up in the game, no. This is just, like- Material that you just it because it doesn't matter because it's a video because it's a Mega Man game story doesn't matter But it's nice to know these little things Okay, so you see that what happened? This is a stage I don't particularly care for because it's like you're on the clock to get to the end of the area and I don't fucking like it like when as soon as it's um you see an arrow go down That means you lose the rank because you need to get the S rank in every area so you can get the Pacific thing like see I got a heart tank. There's a heart tank um, I think he, another sub tank, I think, or a weapon tank, and um, X's armor piece. Shit. So, uh, if I fuck up and lose here, then uh, I would just basically just have to die and restart. Alright, I made it in time. The third one is the hard one. The first, yeah, the first two are easy to do. Yeah, okay, so. The last one is the, you know, um, the armor piece, so... I, I hope I don't fuck up. Hurry up! Oh yeah, I forgot to do, like, the thing, you know, the... Uh, because the battle network thingy. Fuck it. It's too late now. <laughs> That's not what I wanted to happen. I'm wasting fucking time here. Come on, X, hurry up. Oh, see? Okay, I messed up. I gotta die now. So I didn't make it in time. So I kept getting caught. Because you're allowed to get caught at least, like, probably at least once. Oh, thank you. So, yeah, like, this, I don't like this stage. This stage isn't fun. Well, it's, it's fine after this. It's just this is the part I don't like about it. Um, where I rank this with the rest of the Mega Man X games, this is like my second favorite. Despite, you know, this stupid shit in here. And, you know, the ride, the ride bike section. It's like, it's just like, this Mega Man X game is just like, a very solid X game. It's like, there's nothing like, in like, extremely wrong with it. It's not like, oh, there's this stupid thing I don't fucking like. 
All right, got it. There's just some things here and there. It's like, oh, this is dumb. This is dumb. But overall, I love the pack. I actually really like this game. I'm giving you a new head module, X. This module will improve your special weapons and abilities. It should reduce your special weapon energy requirements near zero. You must now use your special weapons as often as you want. Wait, 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 wait. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up. Oh, wait, wait. I, I, was, I was like, so now I'm just allowed to just use as much as I want. So... Weapon tanks mean nothing now. Okay. <laughs> I don't think they really thought that one through. So, the gimmick of this one is that things are gonna fall down and you gotta go, like, be careful and shit. Okay, I don't like that move. I don't like that ability. Ah! <laughs> Fuck! Press the button. <laughs> Die! I don't like this one either. This one I actually need to use on the boss, so... Or is it this one? I don't remember. I mean, you know what? I'll try to experiment with these things, like, on my own time when I'm not Let's Playing, because I'm wasting time doing that. Alright, let the ball fall. Let the ball fall. And it falls there. Puzzle? Question mark? It was like, I'm pretty sure most people will probably just do that without actually really thinking about it. Now, I think his weakness is the fire power up. No. Yes. No. Yes. I will find out during this fight. His, hmm, his potential. Is it limitless? Not possible. Who are you? <laughs> X, are you gonna keep saying that? Who are you? And why are you doing this to me? What? <laughs> why are you doing this to me? I don't like fighting Mavericks, fuck! I, I was ordered to test your abilities. It's quite simple. What? Prepare yourself! You see right there? That's a Maverick sign, not a Repliforce sign. No, that's not his weakness, that's not his weakness. This is weakness? Oh god, I don't know his weakness. We might be in trouble, boys. You gotta press X, not start, when using these. Oh no, we're in trouble. <laughs> I don't have his weakness. I do not have his weakness. I, I I thought I did. What the hell is his weakness? Um, it can't be frost. No, frost is a. Oh fuck! What is his weakness? Oh boy. Well, I might have to go Buster Boys with this one. Cause this boss is free if you have his weakness. This and zero. But he's a bitch. A really hard bitch to fight if you don't have it. So yeah, not every fight your boss you're gonna fight is a fucking weapon force guy. This one's a maverick. Oh, what? Yeah, okay. Okay, I'm doing really bad. <laughs> Cause like this thing, like this thing right here is fucking hard to dodge.
Oh god. I, 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 I'm actually surprised I won. <laughs> cool. Yeah, Mega Man. This one's a little weird. That this power up's a little weird. We'll see it when we play Storm Owl, but um, that I have to wait until later because it's been an hour. So I'm gonna take a break. I'm gonna and I have to do stuff today. So I might come back to record the rest of the game today, but who knows? As of just right now, I gotta take a break because it's been an hour, and you know how it, it might be just be my computer is just not that strong, or it's just you know the Elgato does not record like recording over an hour, but. Because sometimes when I play, like, old games, like, on a PS2 or some shit, it's fine. Like, on, a, on an older system, it's fine if I record longer, but sometimes it doesn't. So, and it might just depend on the system and my computer, but whatever. Yeah, let's save. Look at all the stuff I have. I only need two more armor pieces, two more Mavericks to fight, so... Um, I'll be, we'll be right back after, uh, after a break. Um, take two. <laughs> and we're back. And maybe this time, the Galta won't be, won't be losing its mind this time. It's time for Storm Eagle. We're back for more Mega Man X4. He left the Space Fortress to conquer the air! Wait, if the space fortress, but wouldn't the space fortress be like in space or going over space? Why does he want just the air? <laughs> so, um, what I said before that um, Storm Owl, I, from what I remember, from what I've seen from the the complete works thing, is that Storm Eagle and Owl are either a uh, family or close friends, and Storm Eagle, I mean Owl, hates X for um, taking out Storm Eagle. So I, I think um, Storm Owl was also part of the Repl Force, so that's a thing. So this is the other uh, ride armor. And this one doesn't use sword slashes, but it shoots like X. Um, the sword slashy one's better, but this one does way more firepower because it does a charge, att charge shot attack. But unfortunately for the charge shot attack, you can't move when you're charging. Watch this shit. Yeah, no, X is fine. <laughs> the laser beam didn't hit him at all, clearly. So it's like, it packs a punch, but you can't, you know, move when you're doing this. So it's a double-edged sword, I get it. On the way. You're through. I gotta make this through at least for the most of the level. Also, I'll say this right now, this has the best song in the game. In my opinion, like Storm Owl's um stage, I think has the best song, and that's the that's the halfway point. Like um, where I rank Mega Man X music, I think I would rank this in I think number three, because my favorite is um, despite me hating the fuck out of the game, is X Six. Like X Six is a really good soundtrack, despite it being really bad. Um, after that, it's probably X One. But then after that is pro is this one. Then X2. No 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 no. Okay, I gotta rethink this again, because X5 has Izzy Glow, and Izzy Glow has like the best song in the universe. I gotta really think about that. Okay, so this sucks. Cause the, the up here is where the um the fucking uh arm piece is at. So you gotta use the web spider power to get up there. But you have to shoot it in a very, very awkward angle. Hope I don't touch the spikes. Uh, shit. Okay. So that was my fault because I um, slid into the spikes and then press X fast enough. But you have to basically do that and do and do up a very specific jump to get over there. And it fucking sucks. It's really hard to do. Or at least for me. 
this is that's also like the reasons like a couple of the reasons why I don't like playing as X in um X4. Like it's fine, but Zero, you don't have to worry about this shit. You don't have to worry about going up there. You don't like you don't have to worry about getting pieces. You just get the um the heart like the heart pieces and the E sub tanks and jank. You don't have to worry about getting armor pieces. There we go. So here's the fun thing about this. There's two arm pieces. One over here. I don't know why they hit this one over here, and one right here. This one right here gives you you charge you can charge up, and it'll give you basically four star stocked charge shots. I never use this, but um, I think speedrunners use this. But I'm not a speedrunner, and I don't want to do more. Oh, I don't know. Use this. Better, better use this for the let's play. So I'm gonna use the safe route and use this one. This one, um. Shoots make bigger shots with the um the charge shot, but um it hits multiple times. So anything that it hits with invincibility frames, because like after a certain amount of hits, it will just make you the enemy invincible from the attack. So that's the only ne big negative about this. But if you're going for the little guys, this is really good to take out the little guys. The charge shot one the, with the stocked four, that one's probably good with like bosses and stuff. You can charge up four blasts at a time with the arm module. It takes you a while to charge, but you can fire a charge shot anytime you wish with it. For this arm module, it's also chargeable, and you can also charge. You, you enter this capsule for your charge parts. Whatever. Also, I like how they um when you get a piece, they highlight the completed set. So you can be like, oh yeah, I'm getting one step closer to the completed product. Oh wait, no, this is the one, this is four stock, my bad. So you see the icon on the left, see I got four charge stock, like one, two, three, four, and you can just use that on, it's probably like a boss, uh, you know, you go for bosses. Well yes, on part, you can fire the plasma shot which is effective against stronger enemies. If the shot hits the opponent, the plasma is generated which will cause the additional damage to the enemy. This module is changeable. So use the capsule to change plots. Also, this is the one that carries because um, um X5 carries the armor ar the armor from this game over. So and this is the I guess technically the cannon armor. Also, you get red arms. So this is what it's supposed to look like. Yeah, look at that. Look how big that charge shot is now. I will never miss. No. Fuck. <laughs> X, make up your goddamn mind. <laughs> Alright, don't fuck up. Oh wait, I can hover. Yeah. So this boss is easy to defeat as zero. But I guess you can defeat it easily as X with this thing. You see how it's going down really fast. There we go. That's why I like it. It's good for bosses that don't have invincibility frames. But like I said before, um, not um, a lot of bosses in this game do have it, so just be wary of what you're going to use. So here's the weapon you got to use the defeat Storm Owl with. This one's a little weird because you got to control this with the D-pad. That's also it counts as your movement, so uh, you, you'll see what I got to do. How dare you destroy my unit! You'll pay for this with your life! Say R Ripple Force. Take this. So you gotta just basically aim it at him. And it'll just kill him. And this is the fight. This is the whole fight. Yeah, it's way easier to beat this guy as X than Zero. This, this is the fight. <laughs> And that's it. Yeah, Mega Man. What do we get? You got double Okay. Blah, 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 blah.